All right, so there's just gonna be more cowbell in this video if you get that reference. Good on ya. Happy Sunday, everybody. All right, so I needed to go to the mall again. Do not want to, but I need to go again to take the kids because Sophie is very, very tall. We just found out today that she's over 48 inches. She's she's hit four feet, a little more. Um, and quite frankly, trying to figure out what shorts, like warm weather clothes, like shorts or skirts will fit her and be long enough to be like okay by the school is very difficult. <laughs> so anyway, I've got to take her with me. So, and Grayson wants to go too. So I'm taking both of the kids and Kyle's gonna stay here with Audrey and he's quite happy. He's quite pleased with himself. He's like, ha ha, have fun. I'm like, you go shopping. <laughs> this one's having fun and this one's bored. <laughs> We're off to the okay, <laughs> They're trying not to step on the cracks so they don't break my back, which is very, very nice. Hey, come stick to the sides, guys. Right on. Yep. What's happening? Hi. Grayson, you want a high five? <laughs> this one's sleeping. <laughs> He's thrilled. He's thrilled. Dream come true. Did you guys have fun? Yes. Who, who did we get to see? Grandma. That's it. Wow, was it fun? Yeah. You guys, what did you, did you guys ride the train? Yeah. They did, they went and rode the train. But, but Grandpa I... took them so there's no footage. Look <laughs> guys, there's Audrey. She's so excited, she's jumping. <laughs> she's so excited. Hi Audrey. Naked. Naked. She said hi so she is naked. I wonder if they were about to take a bath or something. All right, I got some Sephora goodies that I ordered. So I'm gonna open this bad boy up. So uh, you know when you order from Sephora, you always get samples. So I got some Becca samples. Even the light looks too dark for me, but <laughs> I'm sure that's just the picture. First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. Oh, and then I got because I have a ton of beauty VIB or whatever it is. They're they're a little. Th I have a ton of points, so this is one of those like um to, like more. Deluxe samples? I don't even know what they call them, you guys. I don't know, but I got this to try because it had really good reviews. Vital Power Infusion. I just thought there was only a select of things you could pick, and this was the only thing that kind of interested me. So, I'm going to see try this out. It was my birthday, so I got a birthday gift. So I got this Marc Jacobs set. Isn't that nice? Like, what a cool, like, little... This was... They had two birthday choices to choose from. And then here is what I actually got. It's, it's so loud. They're playing a cowbell upstairs, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, so there's just going to be more cowbell in this video if you get that reference. Good on ya. Okay, so I got their uh, antibacterial blah 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 deluxe brush set. So I really needed some, I wanted um, some of the eyeshadow brushes they had in this one. They had this exact set, like I mean it came with the same brushes, but it was a a really really pretty like brush handles and I picked it out and I, I had it on my Christmas like my personal Christmas list I got a Sephora gift card for my birthday so I was like perfect I'm gonna go get it and then they were out I was like wah, wah. but they had it it's the same set just with a different brush color it's still nice looking so yeah and it came in this little case I have um, other brushes Sephora brushes and I love them as much as I love some other of the big brands okay now she's playing the piano I'm telling y'all I cannot win Alright, and then I got the Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour uh, Brush. I'm really excited about this. It has really good reviews. I watched tons of people using it and I really liked it. Um, some people wanted it to be denser, but I don't like that, so it was perfect for me. And I just, I needed to update my brushes anyway, so I thought this is cool and easy. So yeah. So that's all I got, really. That's all I actually got, and then it's just a bunch of samples. But like I said, like this premium deluxe sample, I don't know. I used it was like a hundred points, um, and then the birthday thing. 
So yeah, cool. I might have already vlogged this today, but I think, I don't remember if I told you guys that she hit four feet. Like, she's like, well, she was like 48 and something inches, like over four feet. Oh, we were just like, what? So that means she can ride like Expedition Everest and, and um, like all of those Space Mountain, all those rides at Disney World now, if she wants to. I don't know if she'll want to, but she can. How crazy is that? I was like, oh my gosh, how do I have a over four foot six year old? Like, I don't know, it's crazy. So she just seems, I know that some kids are taller than that. I'm not saying that's like the tallest. It's just, she's so tall to me. I was like, no wonder all her skirts and shorts were like really short because she grew a lot. I want to measure Grayson. I want to see how tall he is because he definitely like, he needs 5T for height. Like, absolutely. Like, there's no way. And so, um, but he's kind of a thin little boy. And so it's like, uh, I had to get him 5T and everything, but he's got like a little gap. But I mean, he's just, he's just too tall for the 40s. And my sister had a job interview nearby. And so, if she gets it, she'll move here. Like she'll be a lot closer to us. So that would be really awesome. She used to live really close to us, but then she moved away. And so um, hopefully she'll get this job and she'll get to move closer. And so that's what we're hoping. So yeah. So I think today's vlog is probably a little short because we were really busy. Like it's hard to film when there's like that many people around. Plus my sister hates being on camera. So I try to not film a ton when she's around, but that is going to be it for today. And I just filmed a plan with me video, my second one. And I, the only thing is, is like here, I'll give you guys a little like blurry sneak peek. I just feel kind of weird because like, I mean, the planner videos I see online, they're so decorative. And I think that's what makes them fun to watch. And mine are just like really functional and not necessarily like super decorative. And so um, I don't know if this is something I'll keep doing or not, but I did have a lot of people who were just like, yes. And so I don't know, I guess maybe there's like more people that do it like that. Plus the thing is too, is I think um, some people, I think it's, I think it's kind of cool to share just because I like to show people like how helpful it can be like it can be really like I said it's like kind of therapeutic and helpful if I did a video about it about like how I plan like why planning is like works for me and whatever it's it's very um like I sit down when the kids are either already asleep or about to be asleep I put on some YouTube videos or some Netflix and I I always have a little notebook that I keep that through the week I'll jot down like to do's or important things to remember and like um then I take that little notebook with me and then I have like my um, digital calendar that is shared like with Kyle and I have my OneNote where I schedule and plan out all my YouTube stuff. So I have all that open and I sit down and I look at my week and I figure out like how I want like to do things, you know? And it is so helpful to me. I am way more productive doing this like it, it gives me goals i guess like it helps me with like big to do's and it helps me with like you know um the smaller task and it just helps me kind of focus and think about like what would i want to get done this week what's important to me this week and you know so yeah i like doing it. it's pretty cool but anyway all right well i'm gonna call it a night but i'll talk to all you guys later so i hope you had a great day and i hope you have a wonderful tomorrow and i will see everybody in the next vlog bye guys